Good morning everyone and welcome to Catania in Sicily. It is Friday the 9th of October, shortly past midnight in the morning and uh, yeah, I'm gonna run again. Next to Catania is uh, Mount Etna, a volcano. It's around 40 kilometers there to close to the top. So I'm gonna run there and run back and I'll take you along. Join me. Okay, we're a couple of kilometers in. Etna is actually an active volcano. Last couple of days it has been emitting black smoke. It's always a bit going on, but apparently okay at the moment. But that's also the reason why I can't go to the top, because I needed a guided tour. The main problem though is, in total it's 2,900 meters up, and for somebody who's normally living in Amsterdam, that's a lot. <laughs> okay, here we go. So, Etna south side, I'm uh, 13, 14 kilometers in. It's constantly going uphill. That's going okay. I'm now getting slowly out of the full villages and it's getting a bit a bit quieter every now and then. It's almost two o'clock in the morning. Okay, let me check in. I'm 24 kilometers in. It's going well. Uh, you are uh, perhaps wondering why I'm always running at night or you tr I try to run at night. And uh, the reason is pretty simple. Uh, it's pretty warm here and at night, night it's nice and cool. That's one. Secondly, the traffic here is insane and during the day it's far too dangerous and the air quality is rubbish. So at night I don't have that problem, it's brilliant. I haven't seen a car for the last two hours. And third, it is beautiful. The moon, the stars, I can see Catania behind me. It's beautiful. Definitely highly recommendable. All right, let's keep on going. I'm on the last bit. The bright lights in the front are uh, the lift, and down there is Catania. It's gorgeous up here. Freaking cold, but gorgeous. Walking up a, a road full of uh, full of gravel and ash and dust, very steep, but it's fine. Almost there. Halfway that is. The sun is coming. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. Good morning everyone and welcome to the Philosopher's Tower on top of Mount Etna. Well, the summit is behind me in the clouds, uh, I'm not allowed to go there. But I came here on time for the sunrise. That's the reason why I ran through the night. 40 kilometers, 2950 meters up bang on time with the sunrise. I'm so lucky. All right. Not just 40 kilometers, luckily almost all downhill, but let me take a short rest. And this is an old crater. I put the name in. It's much steeper than it looks. Right, let's go down. And to prove a point that comes from the volcano, that is not a cloud that comes from the volcano. Fucking hell, this is awesome. Oh, I love it. This is brilliant.
So we're off the main mountain and now along a pretty boring street that goes back to Catania through a couple of villages. Perhaps I'll show you a couple of shops. All right, so I'm back where we stay. Uh, in the end, it was 82 kilometers with 2,900 and something meters up and down again. The, uh, the night section was quite good. I liked it a lot. The, uh, the stars, the moon and the city beneath me, that was just very, very nice. Um, yeah, pushed hard to make the sunrise and I'm so happy I did that because that section was awesome. So great to have seen that. I'm so happy that I pushed hard for it. Um, yeah, and the long downhill back here, that didn't work. My, uh, my quads are shot, my uh, feet are flat, so that isn't really mine. <laughs> Who knew? Amsterdam's not the best way to prepare you for that. Anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and um, I hope I see you next time. Cheers. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Edna. -bye,